You know, today we're, we're involved in a, in a conservation project in behalf of bighorn sheep, although all wildlife will benefit from it. Unfortunately, because of how dry we've been, we're in a 21st year of a long-term drought. The last year, 2020, is extremely severe and 2021 hasn't started out much better. And so we're hauling water on the mountain to benefit bighorn sheep, but all wildlife species in the area will benefit from it. Yeah, where we're hauling the water is to a project, a, a water development project. We call them guzzlers, and they're designed to trap and store rainwater in underground tanks and then disperse it to a drinker. It's available to sheep during the hot months of the year to kind of carry them through that time. And so the, the drinker works on a system as the water goes down in the drinker, then the water from the tanks, the storage tanks, then backfills. So they always have water, as long as we have water in the tanks. Normally it's the, the seasonal rains, the, the rains we get between November and February to fill these tanks up and then they get replenished with the monsoon. We really haven't had either one of those for a while. Our conservation efforts on behalf of bighorn sheep is that in 1967 we had about 2,500 to 3,000 bighorn sheep statewide. Today, thanks to projects like guzzlers or our trapping and transplanting efforts, we're up to about 12,000 sheep statewide.